All right, here we are. We're going to 690 South Date Avenue in Alhambra, California. This is the new gym. You'll come in. This is where the front desk will be. That is going to be all of our dumbbells and where the big trash can in will be uh, the benches. You come over here. This is one of the emergency exit hallways. That's one emergency exit door right through here will be a staircase that leads up to the mezzanine. This will be our little lounge area where we'll have, I guess, a kitchenette, table and chairs, a couch, and a, and a big screen TV so we can just chillax in here. People can do interviews. You'll come back out because obviously there'll be walls everywhere, so we won't get the ability to just walk through the walls like my children are. But you'll come through. And the first bathroom is the gentleman's bathroom. You'll come in. And over there will be two uh, toilets and then two urinals. Here will be the double sink. Come in over here. Every guy's going to have their flex mirrors right here. It'll be the vanity in the ladies' room, but this will be a flex mirror for the gentleman. I'm just kidding. The three showers. One shower here. And then the big ADA. We'll probably do some lockers along this wall right here. There'll be nine foot ceilings in here so it won't feel cramped or claustrophobic. We'll come on down, come out, walk all the way down, go back into the ladies. We have not made it through the gym yet. Ladies is opposite, nearly. But again, the flooring's a little different. This will actually have four stalls, no urinals, obviously, for the ladies. Come over here, the double sinks the vanity area for here and then the showers one two three and again a little bench and a set of lockers inside of here come around for the five years we've been doing all the towels and service at our own house but here we're going to have a utility room so we'll be able to store everything in here and nothing inside the gym itself so this is pretty big. There's our special lamb beams that we had to have made for the structural integrity. If you look up there, you can see the height of the piece of plywood. That's where the flooring for the mezzanine will start at 10 feet up. So maybe I'll do a little basketball hoop here on the corner and we can shoot some hoops. I'm just kidding, people don't get too excited. Big roll up door, everything's starting to come together. Again, all said and done, once the mezzanine's built, this is going to be 10,000 square feet. That section right there is where the 14-person squat rig will be. I believe I can do 14. I could be wrong, but maybe it's only 12. But right there where that plywood is that you see will be the stage in which um, constant squat bench combo racks, USPA approved, and kilo plates will always be available and in that corner starting and going down 90 feet 30 yards will be turf and here in the middle where I'm at will be all of the exercise equipment and right where they're deadlifting will be deadlift platforms so we'll have five dedicated deadlift platforms six benches two incline a decline a shoulder press our typical 10 station and then all in this area right here will be where our leg presses, all the leg equipment, and all accessory work for your back and shoulders and arms will all be in this area here. And so it should be nice and fun facility to come to. It's certainly nice to see everything come into fruition for what my wife and I have been wanting to do for the last three years. Anyway, this is a longer video, but this will go up on YouTube and Facebook. So this will be uploaded to our channel. You guys enjoy. I can't put this on Instagram, but this is it so far. So you can see there's a person in there and you can see the, the real world size. Amber, come along and just stand next to the mezzanine where Devin's at. And that is, Amber's five feet tall, so that's up there. Wow, that's like 11 feet. That's going to be awesome. Anyway, thank you 
for staying with us for so long, and we hope you enjoy the new facility. So on behalf of Mission Fitness Center, we thank you so much, and have a wonderful day.